all to you. Welcome back to the AO News Show 325. I am AO, and you are Roll of Paper Towels. Google is racist. No surprise to me. A decent disclosure from the boss of the internet has revealed current workforce percentages. 2% black, 3% Hispanic, and 30% women. Now, that doesn't mean that 65% are white men, because the first three I listed are most likely intermixed. The graph you are seeing right now is obesity rates. Yes, I know, I can't read it too, but according to the source, nearly 30% of Earth's population, 2.1 billion people, are overweight or obese. Worse yet, the overweight rate of children has increased by 47% over the past 33 years. I blame McDonald's and their targeted advertisements of healthy food choices for children. If you are a wine enthusiast, especially of the Italian variety, listen up. 30,000 bottles of fake high-end Italian wine was confiscated by Italian police in the Tuscany region. And if I know my statistics correctly, that's only the beginning. So I would hold off on buying any expensive wine from Italy until further notice. 16-year-old spoiled sack of shit Vincent Parker has admitted to killing his parents. Now, you're probably asking, Ayo, why did he do this horrid atrocity? I'll tell you why. They took away his iPod. A sad tale to tell, especially since this kid was an honor student. WikiLeaks, the one website that can state with full honesty that it is trying to make the world a better place, has uncovered that Google and the National Security Agency are buddy-buddy. According to this leak, Google assisted the NSA in wiretapping all incoming and outgoing calls from the Bahamas and Afghanistan. It is truly sad that our national anthem states that we are the land of the free, when in actual fact the United States of America has more prisoners per capita than any other country in the history of Earth. I state this because our own prisons have become torture chambers. Around 80,000 prisoners within our detention facilities are held within solitary confinement for years at a time. Now, we all know that being black, Hispanic, proactive, anything else non-white or against the wishes of our corporate dictatorship is an offense that can get you arrested, but this is beyond unacceptable. Daily History Corner! In 1848, Wisconsin became the 30th U.S. state. In 1931, Michel Chiru, United States citizen and anarchist against fascism, was executed by the Italian military via firing squad for intent to assassinate Benito Mussolini. Surprise, surprise, the United States government did nothing to stop the killing of one of their own subjects by foreign enemies' hands. And in 1999, Space Shuttle Discovery completed the first docking with the International Space Station. Geek and Gamer News. Independence Day, that one movie that first opened my child eyes to the fact that the U.S. government could actually be lying, is getting a sequel, Independence Day 2, War of the Worlds. And speaking of sequels, World War Z, a movie that enforces the fact that the book is better, is getting one as well. World War Z, Apple fanboys. All those stories and more are linked in the underbar, as well as links to my Facebook and Twitter. Don't forget to look right and left at every intersection, or any fast and subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow. But, 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 she's not a tree, right? I can touch my nose with my tongue.